Drill number three, speed training. One of the most important things in golf these days is that we can generate a lot of club head speed. So by doing these speed drills, you'll actually start increasing your club head speed by four to five miles an hour on the driver. Now, four or five miles an hour on PGA Tour players might even mean more for you when you're doing these drills. So one of the things that we've got to do for speed training is obviously, just as it sounds, it's speed. So we're going to get up to the top. We're going to use the long response setting at the top. And then we're going to move our body as quickly as we can. So again, from the core out, we're swinging and we're going as fast as we can. So here we go. We're going to get up to the top. And you want to do this about just like you work out in the gym. You do th two sets of fives or three sets of fives and then that's it. Then you go back another two or three days later and do it again. We don't need to keep pounding this drill. So here we go. Up to the top. We're going to stop. And again, we're just gonna swing as fast as we can. And once you start feeling those muscles working, you'll start understanding that this is where I get club head speed from. But again, it doesn't come from the top of the backswing or the backswing, obviously we're loading up, but all power hitters in golf, they have a nice smooth backswing and then they just generate a ton of speed on the downswing. So again, take another look at this. Drill number three, speed training. We're gonna go up to the top. We're gonna wait and we're gonna move our body as quickly as we can. So do a few reps of those every two or three days and I guarantee your club head speed on the drive will increase dramatically.